the answer is colossal failure. There is no other way to put it. Urban Meyer is a bad dude. And then number two in the NFL, Urban Meyer is a bad coach. Just telling other coaches you're a loser and you suck and I don't know why you hired you. Between coaching them hard and then maybe being disrespectful and crossing the line. Your Jacksonville Jaguars have found their new head coach. Doug Peterson. Doug Peterson. Doug Peterson. Ladies and gentlemen, the new head coach of Jacksonville Jaguars is Doug Peterson. And to our fans, listen. I know you've been through a lot. You've been through a lot, even this past season. But that's about to change. all of camp and then yeah of course you know you want to play um, but you also realize what the coaches are doing and you know it's a long season like being a part of it last year 17 games plus hopefully playoffs all that um, it's a long season so you know it's a marathon and don't want to get too far ahead of yourselves but I, I, whenever that what time is I'll be ready to roll and get out there and A long season and day one um, doesn't have to be your best day um, just to keep building and getting better every day and I think we have a lot of maturity on the team. We wanted to win each week you know I know the results in it didn't result to the wins but we took each day we didn't take each day for granted we came together as a whole as a defense man as an offense we talked it out we learned we grew. Yeah absolutely we're you know we're really excited about uh, the, the talent the type of team we have um, and, you know, it's our job as coaches to utilize what we have. Listen, the bottom, the bottom of my heart, I mean, I couldn't be more proud of a group of men. Plans, fires at the back of the end zone. That ball is going to be caught for the touchdown. Jahan Dotson, the rookie, caught and he lobbed it up in the back of the end zone. So he's going to get hit. He's going to get sacked all the way back in the 25 yard line. Trayvon Walker got it. Play fake. Trevor drops the throw this time. Fires deep downfield. He wants Christian Kirk. Christian makes the dive. He can't hit his touchdown around the 16 yard line. Trevor rolls right. Fires into the end zone. Caught for the touchdown. Ball is going to be intercepted by Tyson Campbell. He broke in front of the receiver and he picked it off on the far sideline. That was picked off. It is intercepted by Trayvon Walker at the line of scrimmage. Any idea how hard it is to intercept the ball in that short of an area by a defensive lineman, no less? Center. Toss to the right to James Robinson. James to the 10, inside the 10, inside the five yard line. James Robinson into the end zone. Fires deep downfield this time, and that ball is going to be caught by McLaurin for the touchdown.
Dave Robinson. They're going to hit him. They're going to sack him. Josh Allen. Seven yard line. They're running with Dave Robinson. Dave did in the open field. 30. Inside of 30. Inside the 20. To the 10. To the 5. Touchdown. James Robinson exploded and extended the lead. Play fake. Rivers going to run to the right. He's going to toss it to Christian Kirk for the touchdown. Back line. Fire. That ball is going to be intercepted. Picked off by Devin Lloyd after it was tipped. Got a lot of a lot of room for improvement. Um, like I said, we've we've played some really good football this season. We've we've played some bad football too. So um, it, the only thing it says is we got to get better, and that's that's the message. Whether we win or lose, we we got to like I said, we got to hold each other accountable, hold ourselves accountable, and we got to get better. And um, we all just have to do our part. And like I said, our, our team does a good job of staying together. No one's going to point fingers, but we do have to step up and and make the plays that are there, and and really just be more consistent all the way around. You know, these are obviously, these last couple of weeks are tough, you know, tough to take, especially as hard as the guys work and, and play. It's frustrating. I mean, we say the same thing every week, so it's, it's kind of, it's tough. And, you know, obviously I'm, I'm pretty upset and frustrated and disappointed in myself and the way we, the way, we, you know, I finished the game. Uh, obviously, um, they battled, you know, but again, it's, a, it's an opportunity to get better this week and um, learn from the film. You know, coaches and players, and um, just just get back to work. You know, nobody's gonna, you know, as we say, feel sorry for us. You know, and um, we just have to we just have to keep grinding and, and, and keep going. Um, that's what's frustrating for us too, as players. You know, you put you put so much into it, and coaches too, obviously, you put so much into it, and um, to come up that short, especially this many times early in the, in the season, is is frustrating, and everybody feels that, and. Um, Guys are sticking together. I mean, we got a lot of we got a belief. We got a lot of belief in that locker room, and, and you saw it today. And I mean, we come up a yard short at the very end uh, to win win that game by a point. Kick their point, we beat them. So it's that's how close it is, and that's why I think you see um, the look on the guys' faces and just the the energy. And that's the way it should be when you when you're losing like that. You know, no one's obviously happy about it. Yeah, that one too is you know it's unacceptable there. Um, we got the turnover, you know. We got the interception, and we had the rough in the passer. And again, these are these are plays that are that are keeping us back. And, and uh, you know, uh, we just can't do that. You know, we can't do that as, as players. Uh, obviously, as coaches, we, we got to be smart too. You know, decisions we make it's, it's, it goes hand in hand. And um, those are those are those are big plays. Yeah, you know, it's obviously it's frustrating. I mean, we say the same thing every week, so it's it's kind of it's tough and. Same thing, you know, that I've said every week when I stand up here, and um, you know, I'm obviously I'm I'm pretty upset and frustrated and disappointed in myself and the way we the way you know I finished the game and um, just just have to f continue to find ways to to win these games, like you know, like I've said. So, um, and you know, regardless of, of mistakes throughout the game, um, at the end we just got to find ways to to rally and, and go make the play and. There on the last drive, felt like you know we had all the confidence in the world stepping out there, and then first play, you know I threw it a little bit behind Christian, and um, the nickel K1 made made a good play and, and picked it, and uh, it's kind of it's just the way it ended. So that's tough, you know, being being the quarterback and having an opportunity to go win the game and you don't get it done. That's really really disappointing and frustrating, and I got to look in the mirror and um, I got to play better.
Henderson and the Jags try to end a five-game losing streak after they began the season two and one. Well, if the Jaguars are going to get a win, Trevor's got to be better, arguably coming off his worst performance yet as a pro. He's got to show some mental toughness and bounce back today. Trevor rolls, looks, fires deep downfield, middle of the field. That ball's going to be caught. Christian Kirk makes the catch. Trevor looks. He's going to run for it. First down and four. Stays on his feet in the Raiders' territory. Terrific run. Inside hand on ETN. Inside the five-yard line. He's going to have a first down and four. Got it all the way to the one-yard line. There's that first from Travis ETN. Handles it to give to ETN. Toward the goal line. Touchdown! A one-yard touchdown. Yard line. Jamal Agnew into the open field. 30, 40, 45-yard line. In the Raiders' territory. A terrific return by Jamal Trevor fires right corner of the end zone. Caught for the touchdown! Elton Kirk ran circles around Trayvon Merrick the safety. Into the end zone! Touchdown! Side handoff. This is Pacheco. He had a little bit of a burst. The ball came out. It is picked up on the Jaguars, and they're returning it. That is a break. The Jaguars pick up the fumble. Devin Lloyd picked it up and returned it to the 24 yard line. Oh, man, that's a big time play by the defense. Pacheco's, I mean, up into the middle, flying full speed, and I believe that was the safety. Rayshon Jenkins comes in and puts a hat right on the ball. The ball pops out. Devin Lloyd makes the recovery on the run. That's a huge play for the Jaguars. Looks. Now he fires it out to the right side. Caught by Kadarius Toney, who tight ropes the sideline and walks into the end zone. They run a little jet sweep. This Kadarius Toney into the open field, into Jaguars territory along the right sideline, inside the 35-yard line. Play fake. Mahomes drops. Steps forward, fires. Wide open in the back of the end zone. That's going to be a touchdown. And the Chiefs have extended the lead here in Arrowhead. Look. Fires toward the end zone, wide open in the corner of the end zone. I mean, wide open for a four-man rush. Fires deep downfield, and that ball is a diving attempt. That catches next, knocking on the door. Trevor fires. That ball is going to be caught for the touchdown. Christian Kirk got both feet down, and the Jags score late in the half. Throw three-man rush. Fires left side, caught by Kelsey, into the end zone for the touchdown. He caught it, threw it to him right in the seam there, and he backed into the end zone from a home. Now he fires it downfield. That ball's picked off. It is intercepted by Andre Sisco running it back. Steps out of bounds. What a game he has had. He picks it off and runs it back to around the corner. Trevor look. Fires toward the end zone. That ball is going to be caught for the... Uh, what an amazing job by Christian Kirk. That, that is now nine catches for 105 yards. Drops the throw. Fires deep downfield. And that ball is going to be... Somehow caught. Middle 
the field, Christian Kirk. He got it to the 30-yard line. Now you've got a fourth down play, fourth and five from the 30-yard line. Fires left side, that ball is caught by Marvin Jones. They drop the throw now. Middle of the field, that ball's caught by Christian Kirk. He went out and got it. He has touched down around the 43-yard line. Fires deep downfield, that ball is caught by Zay Jones. He's touched down at the 10-yard line. The clock turns, it's gonna be first and goal, Jacksonville. For the right corner of the end zone. That ball is caught. Caught. Caught for the touchdown. To the right corner of the end zone. How good is that? Touchdown, Jacksonville. Marvin Jones Jr. Fire left side of a caught. Caught. It is good. Jacksonville is taking the lead! How good is that? It's a hell of a win against a great football team, a playoff caliber team. That shows me, shows you right there, that we're right there. And we are right there with them. Yeah, I mean, it was it was amazing. Obviously, it feels <laughs> feels great. Like I, like I said after the game, you know, you put in so much work and to be on, to win the games like that, it's just, it's it's an awesome feeling, um, nothing like it. I mean, it, it, it's it's super cool. And uh, like I said, though, we've been on the other side, so we understand what that feels like too. And I think we're just appreciative of where we are, how far we've come, kind of what's in front of us still. And like we said it's a it's a new season once we got back from the bye week, and you can't win seven games till you win one. We had to start today, and obviously there was some some adversity, and we had to battle through it, and we just found a way, and it was it was incredible. Obviously, either you win or you lose on that play, and he trusted us to go win the game. And you know, a lot of a lot of teams, a lot of coaches would have kicked that, gone to overtime, and he made that decision to trust us and go win it. Um, and I think knowing that, we're in the huddle like there's no no doubt we're going to score right here. Drop. He's hit from behind and sacked by Trayvon Walker, and the ball came out. Rush there by Trayvon Walker against Dennis Daly. The rambling to his right, fired the ball caught by Anthony Stefan. Into the end zone, touchdown. That's a touchdown for Jackson. The shot can be thrown quick. Picked off by Dewey. Running it back to the 45 yard line. Intercepted by Andrew Linger. And that ends up the run on the far side. And Jacksonville has it. What a hit by Shaq Quarterman. Third linebacker on the field. Down pass of 20 yards from Trevor Lawrence to say no. And the Jags take the lead. Sideline, that ball is going to be caught by Jamal Agnew. What a play by Trevor Lawrence. On his own read, tries to get to the corner. Dies for the end zone, touchdown! Great athleticism, great decision making. How about toughness too? I mean, this guy is taking it to another level. For fires left side, that ball is going to be caught for the touchdown in the left corner of the end zone. Are you kidding me? the play, they're booing here at Nissan Stadium. Good job by the defense today, bouncing back last week was a tough outing in Detroit. And they get four takeaways, that's a great job. You weren't perfect, but the four takeaways took up a lot of shortcomings and performance line. Dropping, rolling right, looking down, Phil Fires got a man down there, Zay Jones is down there. Inside the 15 to the 10 to the 5, touchdown! Jacksonville, Trevor Lawrence to Zay Jones, and Jacksonville strikes when they needed it all oh, so badly. The scramble out of there, Jackson's gonna hit him if you let it go. That ball is intercepted in the secondary. Ray Sean Jenkins is gonna run it back. He got it back to the 20 yard line. This Jacksonville defensive line, they're making their presence felt. Big stand. Black, no getting at the edge. Yes, he can. 35, 30, 25. 
20, all over the right sideline, knocked out of bounds inside the 10 yard line. First and goal. Look, first and back in the end zone. The ball's caught, 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 picked off. It is picked off by Rachel Jenkins. He's running it back along the right sideline. That is going to be a touchdown. That is going to be a touchdown. The Jags are going to win it. What a race, Sean Jenkins picks it. Are you kidding me? Goes the blitz. The Jags listen. They hit him. Andre Sisto got him a safety blitz. He got him outside the 20. This is a tight end, one-on-one -on -one against the top corner, arguably, this year. You look at that separation. That initial first step gets him that separation. And the confidence here. They hit him as he likes to go. And they're running it back. The Jags are going to run it into the end zone. Josh Allen scores a touchdown. They can't play because of the injury. You play for them, right? They would give everything to be on that football field with you guys, and you battled for them. And, uh, you know, listen, you know, you're AFC South champs, baby. Oh, man, I just can't describe this moment. I'm going to seal it up and live with it the rest of my life. Uh, yeah. Second down and six. We'll call it a four-yard game. Play fake. That ball is batted in. It is going to be punt fourth down. They snap it quickly, dropping. It's a blitz. Trevor fires downfield, and that ball is going to be picked off. It is picked off. The second interception of the day. Zay Jones wanted a penalty. There was a looking, looking, fires, and that ball is picked off again. The third interception of the day. The second one by Asante Samuel. Fires, and that ball is... That ball's intercepted. Fourth down, dropping the throw, looking, looking, fires middle of the field. That's caught and they convert it. That'll be a first down inside the field. One timeout remaining if Doug Peterson needs it. Shotgun, trips left. Dropping this Trevor, looking, fires back at the end zone. That ball is gonna be caught. For the touchdown by Evans. This time, Trevor fires. That ball's caught. Evan Ingram made a man miss inside of 35 along the right sideline. He's going to get pulled down inside the 25 yard line. Boy, Evan Ingram. Did Jones, Junior for the score.
shotgun from Patrick Mahomes. Two left, two right. Play fake the Jacks blitz. Mahomes hangs in there, fires downfield. That ball's going to be caught by Kelsey. They're second and goal from the eight yard line. Rolling to the right is Mahomes looking. Fires to Kelsey to the five yard line. Into the end zone, touchdown. Puts a foot to it. Line drive kick this time. And Jamal's going to bring it out of there. Going to hit the goal line to the 15 yard line to the 20. Got a little bit of room. 25. Jamal Agnew. 35 40. 45. Hitting the Chiefs territory on the left side. A terrific return by Jamal Agnew. Three to the left, one to the right. Dropping the throw is Trevor. It's a blitz. Fires to the right corner of the end zone. That ball is going to be. Inside handoff to Checo. He gets hit, bounces out of there. 40, 35, 30, 25, 20. Inside, long left sideline, inside the 10. What a run by the rookie Pacheco. They hit him in the backfield. He bounced it outside. He got it all the way to the three-yard line of the Jaguars. Wow, line. Shotgun formation. Now McKinnon goes his back. Play fake. And he goes to the left side. Caught for the touchdown. Travis Kelsey, who else? Fires the ball into the stand. And that is a touchdown for Cam Rush. Trevor looks. Fires deep down. we got a man wide open. That ball's going to be caught. That is Zay Jones. Zay Jones is tapped out of bounds inside the 25-yard line. Trevor under center. He's in the running back. We give us to ETN, reverses his field, dives for the goal line, touchdown! The four-yard touchdown run! Ball's going to field it on the run in the five-yard line, 15, 20-yard line, 25-yard line, Jamal Agnew! Oh! Cut down at the 45-yard line by the kicker. Vaselli almost called that one. Oh, he was oh. one guy away, but wants to run it. 15-yard line, 10-yard line, lowered his shoulders, got him. Ball come out. The ball came out at the end of the run inside the five yard line. 